Salam Alaikum. I want to give all praises, all honor, and all glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rakakwadash, for allowing me to do another lesson. Yahweh is who the world ignorantly calls God. Yahweh Shai is his son, who the world ignorantly calls Jesus Christ, and there's no God beside them. I want to give double honors to the apostles and the elders of, J of Great Millstone, GMS for short, for being faithful witnesses to the Holy Spirit, and Shalom to the elect. A, um, you know, I just want to get this quick lesson in. Um, going into uh, how the EU, because over here in the States, you know, we push that the, the MOTB is the RFID chip. However, in the, the, the EU, across the pond, as brothers say, is known as the NFC. Right, so this same, um, which you know, when you break down what the, the MARK is to its molecule, to its nucleus, rather, it goes into the word grapho, meaning writings. Right, so it says, um, EU to begin large scale European digital identity wallet pilots for multiple use cases. The European Commission has selected four proposals for large-scale pilot programs to test the European digital identity wallet. And um, this lesson probably gonna have to be about eight minutes long because my um, I'm gonna have to go in a minute, you know. But I just want to get this in before the night is over. So it says the European Commission has selected four proposals for large-scale pilot programs to test the European digital identity wallet across multiple use cases including in-store online and cross-border payments travel e-commerce access um access to services and, and credential verification three international consortia of public and private sector organizations nordic baltic eid project the european digital identity wallet consortium and digital credentials for europe dc for eu have confirmed that their proposals have accepted have been accepted by the EC which again stands for the European Commission and have announced plans for trials that are due to begin early next year now um this reminds me of the scripture I believe it's in Acts where it says our um salvation is nearer than we would believe you know because we're looking at you know uh, companies that Esau push out out there like for example Neuralink we see Elon Musk is six months out however there's other companies that's in the same race to um uh for successful human trials all right to put the uh the C hip in, in, in forehead for paraplegics other companies such as Synchron which they're more so in the phase of uh you know uh introducing it to the people Whereas Elon Musk and, and Neuralink is not even uh, past, uh, uh, they're not even successfully uh, testing it, you know? So, hey, man, like I said, what the scriptures say, our salvation is nearer than we believe. The pilot proposed by Norbit focuses, uh, Norbit focuses on payments, one of the priority use cases in the EU's digital ID wallet vision. The consortium of government agencies financial institutions, payment networks, and technology providers from Denmark, Germany, Iceland, Italy, Latvia, and Norway explains. Its implementation will leverage existing payment infrastructures to enable payment insurance, instant payments, account-to-account -account transfers, and payment accepting both in stores and online. This is the proposal put forward by EWC a partnership of more than 40 organizations across all EU member states is focused on the use of EU digital identity wallet in the context of travel, such as providing passenger information, buying goods and services, and trusted business-to-business -business interactions, the consortium says. It will pilot usage scenario alongside complete travel journeys from booking of flights hotels, etc. to check in, shopping and payments all across Europe.
So call low to Yahweh by Shin Yahweh Shai. As the scriptures say in 2nd Ezra, the 15th chapter, I'll write that, um, write them in paper for they are faithful and true. These prophecies are faithful and true. And we're almost home. And the scriptures say in the book of Habakkuk, the, the second chapter, that what? Um, when it shall come to pass, it shall not tarry. So these things are not tarrying. So where there's so-called scares of the of World War Three, all right. Um, hey, the, uh, the 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 famine of the word. All these things are about to come to pass, which we look forward to 2023, and which is uh you know if 2022 is the year of turn up through the Spirit and power of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai, how much more uh 2023? Okay, which like I said, in the book of Habakkuk it says what? It says um. Though it tarry, wait for it, for it shall not tarry. It shall come and it shall not tarry. But it says, uh, DC for EU, the third consortium to confirm the EC has accepted its proposal, will trial the European digital identity wallet and a set of use cases with cross border scenarios in order to verify that it is compatible with the business requirements for education credentials. God damn, bro. So lock it, man. Let me wait till this fucking train passes. So it says, um, DC for you, the third consortium to confirm that the EC has accepted its proposal, will trial the European digital identity wallet and a set of use scenarios with cross-border scenarios in order to verify that it's compatible with the business requirements for educational credentials and professional qualifications and social security. I'm almost done. Um, it will also test its identity and signature capabilities and cross multi-protocol scenarios. The European Union revealed in November that it is preparing to go live with the European digital identity wallet in 2024. And the European Council approved a proposal legislative framework for issuance and usage of the wallet earlier this month you know and um uh okay my train is coming so i'm gonna just end it here however i'm gonna put the the link to this hey so like i said i'm gonna put the link in the description box you know hey man our salvation is nearer than we believe with that shalom to the elect